Esta es nuestra trompeta, se llama guamo. La gente taína son la gente del Caribe, son la gente que la tierra del Caribe parió. Nosotros somos sus hijas y sus hijos. If you come from the Dominican Republic, Haiti, Puerto Rico, Cuba or Jamaica, I'm talking to you. Atabeira Germán My name is Irka Mateo. I am a Taino woman from the Dominican Republic. I am a folk researcher, a Taino culture researcher, and I am also a singer and a songwriter. The Taino people came from the Amazon. They are Arawak. Before Christopher Columbus arrived to the Caribbean, it was populated by, by the Tainos, but they were also people who came from other places, for example, the antecessors of the Maya, the antecessors of the Olmec. Because, you know, if you see the Caribbean, it is so close Cuba from Yucatan. In those times, it was also very active. People were, were very good in the sea, so they will take their canoes and they will go all over the little islands of the Caribbean, the north part of South America, the east part of Central America, and the south part of the United States. So this was very active and, uh, and there was a lot of exchange uh, of culture and also a business exchange. When uh, Christopher Columbus came, they brought diseases that the indigenous people were not used to and they didn't have any immunity to it. So that killed a lot of people in the first contact. Then the, the treatment um, to the indigenous people was very bad. We were slaves, so we died also for all these bad treatments that, that we had. And they were stripped out of their culture, their language, and their rights, their religion, their spirituality, and, uh, and everything that conformed um, the Taino uh, society. Even though this happened, we are still here. There are a lot of our culture in the countryside. And uh, for example, the material culture, we still have the, our houses, the way that um, we used to have them 500 years ago. And also like the methods of uh, fishing, the methods of, of um, of hunting and, uh, and also agricultural methods. And also, there are many words in the, of the Taino language that has come into the Dominican Spanish and even to the world. The word caiman, which is uh, a type of a crocodile, comes from Taino. And we can hear this in the Dominican Republic and other places in Latin America, like Colombia. Se va el caimán, se va el caimán, se va para Barranquilla. Another word that we have of Taino precedence, canoa. Canoa, it's a boat where the Taino people used to go for fishing and also for traveling. Another word is our bed, hamaca. It translated as hammock, iguana is also a Taino name. The way that we cooked was barbacoa, and it translated to English as barbecue. Huracán, everybody knows what a huracán is. In English, hurricane. Manatí is this, um, we call it the sea cow. So it's this beautiful um, mammal that lives in, in the Caribbean and we all love. The word Caribe also comes from the Taino. They were the people who came from the Amazon and inhabited the, the Lesser Antilles. And it is also the name of the ocean, Caribbean. There is a delicious fruit called guayaba and in English it translated as guava. Another word is uh, tobacco, which was used just for ceremonial purposes and uh, four times a year. It is a sacred plant that it was not meant to smoke it every day. This passed to English as tobacco. Actualmente en Nueva York hay un grupo que se llama Iguayagua que está actualmente reconstruyendo la lengua taína y entonces nosotros todos nos estamos beneficiando de más palabras y más palabras y, y de saber cómo construir frases de nuevo, recuperar nuestra lengua. O sea que 
Hasta ahora les hemos dado estas palabras, Taínas, vendrán muchas más. Úsalas en tu vocabulario porque ellas nos pertenecen a nosotros, los y las Taínas.